96 Blitz. Brought to you by Elliott Services and Clark's Pump and Shop. Welcome to sports. I'm Jeff Picoro. Pulaski County has just eight starters back from last year's team, and they open the season against Pikeville on Friday night in the Cumberland Falls Pigskin Classic. Pikeville has won the state three of the past four years in Class A. It will not be an easy game despite Pulaski being a 5A school. Here's Hallie Moore with our ABC 36 Blitz. Pulaski County coming off a 9 and 3 season last year and falling to Woodford County in the second round of the 5A state playoffs. They lost about nine seniors to last year's graduating class, so the group says that they have been adjusting some new faces into their lineup. Well, we've worked a bunch of freshmen in and uh, just new play, some new plays. Over the offseason, the team has focused on improving two key areas for the upcoming season. Our pass game and defensively, our rush, I mean, rush game. And for this group, the goals next year are simple. Be as good as last year. Better, better than last year. This coming Saturday, the Maroons start their season against Danville on the road. The team says that they are working in their last final days to stay physically healthy and mentally calm before the season gets underway. We're just trying to taper. We're just trying to fit some stuff in as slow as possible. Reporting with the Pulaski County Maroons, Hallie DeVore, ABC 36 Blitz.